Hi guys, Devon Wolf from Mystical Drumming, mysticaldrumming.com. Playing all the paradiddles, meaning the singles, doubles, and triples as beats. Yes, you can play paradiddles as beats. I did some of that in uh, the other videos you can see here. Uh, wherein I uh, was showing you how to play paradiddles on the kit, meaning around toms and snares and rims and cymbals, whatever. Uh, but I just want to show you that they can be done just as uh, beats and they make really cool beats and depending on where accents are going to be as well or opening the hi-hat um, uh, crashes and that kind of thing. So I'm just going to, I don't do this stuff with any plan, I just kind of have a general idea and then I just kind of mess with it as I go along. So. And I drop sticks and make mistakes, and I don't start, start, I don't start again. Okay, so uh, whatever happens, happens, and okay, that's it. So yeah, uh, these are not, uh, you know, perfected can things. I want to be real and raw, and that's the whole point. Okay, so yeah, uh, so you wonder like, oh my God, he dropped a stick or something, because I don't hit the stop button and start again. Okay, so whatever happens, happens, and I'm human. Yeah, I'm totally imperfect. Trust me about that. Yeah, um, I'm not a perfect drummer, and nobody is. So, uh, all right, so let's um, play around with some beats with uh, paradiddles. Okay, so I'm gonna turn this way and um, I will look at you as much as I can because I don't want you to think I'm turning my back to you, but so I'm not. Okay, so uh, I'm gonna be over here. I'm right here. Okay, so um, if you were to have, uh, just say, single paradiddle as a beat, right? drum right here so but the bass drum could go on the offbeat different sound or on a diddle right um all right we're just sort of using the hi-hat as a weapon a sound weapon like Strategically to make really cool sounds that way, right? A lot of people don't like the double hit when it's open. I do. I think it has um, what people call sloppy or splashy. To me, that's a good thing, right? Sometimes, so maybe you want, you know. Yeah, I think you know where I want to put that. Yeah, so I kind of like, you know, kind of cool, right? Um, beats don't have to always be done hi-hat, snare, and you can play open-handed as well, right? Um, you can play your floor conference, which makes a great sounding uh, alternative to hi-hat or ride cymbal. So, now it's a beat, right? double paradiddles, right? So we got this double paradiddles, if you count them out, well first of all, the regular paradiddle, it's right, really one beat and uh, we're just doubling on one stick, right? One beat and two, or one and two and three and four and it's four, right? So it's kind of cool. Um, well, the double paradiddle, one, Previous videos. In this one, you see about uh, a lot of other stuff about paradiddles, but you get here because this may be confusing if you're not really well versed in paradiddles. And if you're not, you're still okay. Okay, <laughs> don't don't get don't get sweaty about the stuff. It's not serious. Okay, so um, what have we did now? Since we have six notes, it's like a triplet, right? So one trip.
triple parallels, which I did other videos, but that's now eight notes, right? So we have going from a triplet to a triplet field to a fourth field, which is cool. Now we kept it on, um, let's say, as a beat now, right? That's what we're doing here. So we had our double paradiddle as a beat. So. it up a little bit with some other stuff because that's what I felt at the moment. Okay. Um, yeah, so uh, cowbell. Doubling up time. So in other words, uh, you know, uh, we want to go from, let's say, a single parallel. as we so on simple. Right. So uh, something like, you know, um, whatever. up a little bit, you know, where it's not just one, it's, you know. There's so many variations. These are really, really cool beats. Um, they're definitely different. Uh, they break out of the norm, but it's a whole point, right? <laughs> yeah. Uh, so play around with that, you know, and uh, pun intended. Um, use power diddles is um, not just fills, if you're using them as fills, which you should, um, but you know, put them in here, put them in there, and realize that power diddles are totally countable. They're eights and threes. Uh, four, sorry, fours and threes, uh, which you can make into eights and sixes and sixteens uh, and whatever. Okay, so yeah, it's there's so much you can do. Um, okay, if you have any questions and comments, whatever, you know, I do answer all questions. If you want to uh, email us or contact us on YouTube or comment below, I do answer everything. I'm very busy. I uh, also an ent entertainment law attorney and body, mind, spirit, counselor, and other things, okay, yeah, as a mixed martial artist, uh, competitor, a teacher, and other things, so yeah, my biz life is um, busy, uh, to say the least, so, uh, but, um, and professional drummer, so, uh, yeah, so I do the best I can, but I will get back to you, okay, as long as your question um, is respectful, and that's all I ask, is because I give you nothing but respect, uh, so yeah, just keep it respectful and kind and cool, and uh, you'll get nothing back in return but that. If you give anything else, I just won't answer because I just don't respond to negativity. That's it. Yeah, so, yeah. Okay. So uh, with that, as Ringo would say, hey, peace. Okay. So yeah. see you next time.